What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Ash Beezy. It's been a long day at work, as you can probably tell by my voice. I've been talking to people all day. And the shit is like gone, but like, I really need to speak on this because you know what? Some people need to mind their own damn business. And I'm keeping it real. You know what I'm saying? That's as real as I can keep it. So, I've told, you know, I, I've kind of mentioned in a few videos that, you know what? I still live at home. I'm 25 years old. I'm still home with my parents for several reasons, you know, other than just being my damn choice. So, I was talking to this chick today, and um, she's having to ask me, and I'm, you know what I'm saying, I, if y'all ask me an honest question, I'm going to give you an honest answer. I have nothing to hide. I have nothing to be ashamed of. I've lived my life. I did what I had to do. I did what I had to do. That's right. Yeah, you know what I'm saying, and you know what I'm saying, I'm doing me. You should do you. Why the hell are you worried about my situation? So, this chick going to ask, going to uh, say, Oh, so where you live? I told her shit. <laughs> I told her shoot. <laughs> Let me get this right. I told her, you know, look, I, I still at home with my parents still. You know what I'm saying? For several reasons. Um, all of which I'm not gonna disclose to you because number one, I don't really know you like that to be telling you my business. So the chick goes on to say, Well, if you had a husband to take care of you, then you wouldn't have to live at home with your parents, with your mommy and your daddy. Bitch. Bitch. That's your situation. You went out and got married young. And there's nothing wrong with that. I have nothing against married people. Most of my friends are married. Whatever. But for you to come up and say to me that um, I shouldn't be living in my parents' house because I should have found a man to take care of me. No, no, boo-boo. I can tell you right off the bat that we are two different damn scripts. We are two different scripts, bitch. We are two different pages, ho. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just, you know what I'm saying? When people, especially, you know, another female saying that shit to you, you know what I'm saying? That shit is fucking insulting. So, I was slightly perturbed. I was like, you know what I'm saying? This chick gonna come up in here and tell me this. You don't know my situation. You don't know. And I'm not gonna justify anything to you. Who the hell are you? I'm not gonna just. Well, you don't have to get upset. I just meant. No, I know exactly what you meant. Okay, yes, I could be in a serious relationship with someone, but I choose not to be. It is a choice not to be in a relationship. Everyone's different. Everyone's situation is different. Not everybody wants to get married at 22. 25. Shoot. You know what I'm saying? Everybody's situation is different. And I think people should just respect other people's choices. Whatever your choice may be. You know what I'm saying? Just respect people's choices. Because you know what I'm saying? You don't know their situation. You, you haven't walked their shoes. You don't know their life. You don't know what's going on. So for you to sit down past judgment time after I should have been mad. Bitch, you better get the hell on somewhere. You don't even know me like that to be stepping to me incorrect. You don't. And that's all the hell I had to say. Because that bitch there, I was like, that bitch better not look in my direction tomorrow. Oh! She better not look my way, damn it. Because if looks could kill that But I just had to vent on that. And my voice is continuing to crack and sound bad. So I'm going to roll hell out it is like 6 30 and i'm headed home that's crazy as hell overtime like a mother all right peace out y'all